Hi everyone, it's Christina, and I have a Stampin' Up! haul I'm going to share with you. And then at the end of this video, I'm going to show you a few projects I made with some of the supplies. So the first thing I'm going to show you is some 12 by 12 paper, and it is called Home for Christmas. And there's some really pretty music sheet paper here. And the other side is green with little white berries on it. And then really pretty Christmas bulbs, blue and red and green. And that's the other side, red and cream color stripes. And then this one is so adorable. These little, I don't know, little reindeers or little deers is so sweet. And then that's the other side, holly with red berries. And beautiful poinsettia paper, love that. And that's the other side, a beautiful snow scene with the uh, church and little houses and trees, very pretty. This is a real nice teal color, looks like just little snowflakes on it. And Christmas trees and presents on the other side. And Santa Claus, Santa on skates, Santa uh, going down the chimney and red and green and blue stripes on the other side. I also picked up, wow, that looks pretty cool on camera. I bought some red, a couple of sheets of red foil paper. You can see I've already cut some out with a um, banner punch. So really like that. Then I got some ribbon. I thought that would go really nice with that teal paper and some foil doilies, metallic foil doilies, and they come in gold and silver. Then I got these wooden letters. It says, congrats, celebrate, and I forget what the other one. Oh yeah, thanks. Red, real red uh, ink. I love their ink, it's so moist. All right, then I got, these are called Snowflake elements. So you get lots and lots in there. Then I got a die set, and it's the banner frame, ba banners, framelits, dies. And you get six in here, I think. One, two, three. Yeah, six in here. So you know, starting with a really tiny one to a really big one. So I did use those in a few of the projects. I'll show you that. So I'm really happy now that I have some banner dies and I have a banner punch. So Christina is happy. Then I got some of these plain paper bags for embellishing and putting some little presents inside. I got a couple of stamp sets. This one is called Mingle All the Way. There's even a Halloween-y one in there. Oh, and you know what? I think I know why I really like this stamp set. I say Halloween-y all the time. And this one says, spooky, spooky, screamy, screamy, have a happy Halloween-y. Yay! And this one I love. I bought it for these beautiful trees. There's three of them in there. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six stamps in here. Silent Night, these beautiful twigs, the antlers, these little stars. And all is calm, all is bright. I bought some red pom pom. And some sequins. And in here you get some stars and hearts in different colors. And then this is called, it's a button. There are a bunch of button embellishments in here. It's called the Nordic Designer Buttons. And it would go nice with some of the papers that I got. And then I got some punches. I got a heart punch. Love my heart punch. Happy I got that. I haven't used this yet, and I didn't use it in any of my projects, but I can hardly wait. It's two snowflakes. Love that. Actually, I should just try it right now. Yep. I'm going to do some blue snowflakes. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. That's going to be cool. Aren't they pretty? Very nice. And 
then I've been wanting this for so long is I can't remember the name of it but is the it's it punches the top of the tag in a really pretty scallop and then it's got the hole in the middle so I believe this is two inches so if I pop that in there okay so this is a bit small this tag but okay let me do one let me do something that is two inches oh actually I have it right here so that is this tag is two inches in width so I pop that in isn't that pretty I like that so actually I did a whole bunch so love love that and finding if any of you are like me and you've got uh, arthritis in your hands or tendonitis or carpal tunnel and finding dies and punches are really helpful rather than cutting okay so now I'll show you a few projects that I did so the first thing I made was a couple of um, treat bags I embellished them so I used these bags here and I just put on a white doily, a couple of tags, stamped a gift for you. I used those snowflake uh, wooden elements, stamped Merry Christmas. Then I made small treat bags, and these fit um, a gift card in there, so always like that. I used the, um, the foil doilies in gold and used a couple of tags stamped to from on it. Use this uh, um, trim here. Use the pom-pom trim, the wooden snowflake. All right, and then I made some tags, some Christmas tags. I used the deer or the reindeer paper and stamped to and from. There's the heart punch. There's some of those Nordic buttons. Then I made, oh, I love that teal paper. So I see I used the little banner. I used the two different sizes here and stamped to and from. Used a clip here or a clothes peg. And then I made a couple of cards. So I used the teal paper again and then I used that tree stamp. Um, this one right here. And I just uh, stamped it there and there and there. And then I used uh, stickles silver stickles for the sky, a couple of those wooden snowflakes, stamped all is calm, all is bright, used the big banner die, a couple of the big ones, and that music sheet paper in the background, and then I did a little bit on the inside too, and I think, yeah, I used a couple of the banners here, I think I'm going to put a word there, not sure what yet, and then I made one more card, and that's it kind of a plain card. I'm not even sure if I'm finished yet. I stamped this reindeer and I think I'm going to color the reindeer in. I stamped magical. I uh, used that uh, tag topper. This, this one here for the top of the tag. Used a silver doily. And this stamp set has got that little, this one right here, little snowflake stamp. So I just stamped it here and there and added um, some silver stickles. And that's the inside. So yay! Those are my projects. I even have been humming a Christmas tune now and then. And I kind of feel like, you know, should I be doing that? But what the heck, if I want to sing some Christmas tunes, I will because you know what? It always goes so fast, the Christmas season. Next thing you know, it's all over and everything has to come down and get packed up for another year. Alright everyone, hope you're doing well. Thanks for watching. Love you all. Bye-bye.